heading to Colonial Williamsburg and our Airbnb is in an excellent location. It's like three miles away from Colonial Williamsburg. And don't forget, if you have not subscribed to our channel and you love some great travel information and videos, please do that. And if you like this video, please also give it a thumbs up. And a little bit about our channel is we're a mother-daughter team that love to travel and we like to do things such as cruise and fly places. But the next few months we're going to be doing some road trips because the world's a little crazy right now and that's the best way to travel. So our first road trip is in Williamsburg. We've had a great few days and today we're going to have another great day. So let's go. Hi, there's a shuttle from the visitor center at Colonial Williamsburg to the actual Colonial Williamsburg site. So we're on that right now. by the Colonial Williamsburg Foundation. Uh, sadly, the Capitol building, the original Capitol, did not survive. Uh, but like many of our reconstructions, this building is on the original site, based on the original design. This is the gunsmith shop. Heat is then out here, laid out on the counter, are the, the steps and how a gun barrels made. But all of these guns hanging here all are built here in this shop by us. Yeah, well, all except that long one on the very top, that was built about 1750. Wow. So many of the buildings are closed. And the way they tell you to know if a building is open for touring, it has a flag in front of it. And also, um, mask wearing is required in the buildings. But of course, if you're walking down the street and no one's around you, you can go without it. Welcome to the kitchen, everybody. Uh, one of my colleagues made an omelet today. And then we are also, uh, last but not least, doing an onion pie. Baking that out in our brick oven today. It's so cute. <laughs> This is the McKinsey Apothecary. So construction on the palace starts in 1706 and finishes in 1722. And the purpose of it is because they need somewhere to house the royal governor. Now the royal governor, to put it super, super simply, is appointed by the king or queen of England and does his or her bidding. governor's palace and when they all began the king actually had the royal appointed person living here to rule over the land of Virginia. What do you think about the dining room? It's beautiful. It's a lot smaller than I thought it would be. But we always find that when we go visiting like historic palaces and such. It's just so much smaller than you imagine. Yeah. Ball 
ballroom. <laughs> Hannah, where are you going? I don't know. What are you about to do, Hannah? I don't know. <laughs> She's about to go in the maze. I don't know if there is a maze. There is a hedge maze. I don't know where it is. <laughs> I think you're in it. Oh, uh, I don't think this is it. Hannah, where are you going? I think we found the maze. <laughs> we found it. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I guess left. <laughs> so left was a good thing? <laughs> no! No! Turn around! No! <laughs> oh shoot. <laughs> oh shoot. <laughs> Go left this time. <laughs> I don't think that's the right answer. No! It's no, not. it's not the right answer. <laughs> Left or right? <laughs> Let's go with left. <laughs> oh shoot! Is it not? Left or right again? <laughs> Let's go with left. We did it! <laughs> <laughs> all of the outer buildings are reconstructed. The house, on the other hand, is original. It mm. just wasn't all built at the same time. car and we have spent pretty much the entire day here at Colonial Williamsburg. Um, Hannah's still driving us home. Anyway, so we stopped, we ended by um, getting, catching the bus back to the visitor center and we did some shopping in the store. So we're going to have to get up early in the morning and go to Monticello. So we're going to end the vlog here for the day and if you haven't subscribed to our channel please do so and hit that thumbs up. We appreciate it. We look forward to showing you a little bit more of Virginia.